Damn, old dude walking around with a big ass chain. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> he got a big old dog chain on his uh on his <laughs> like yeah. Like you know one of those big ass uh I don't know big it's a big ass chain. this bike guys welcome to the vlog short little video i'm a part of this z900 forum on facebook a whole bunch of people that own uh, z900s all over the world mostly in, in the u.s out here but uh we've been there's been this trend of people posting up this front nose fairing that uh comes at the front of the bike right by the headlights and if you follow me on instagram you probably seen that i did get one there's a whole bunch of places that you can get it ebay i think amazon has it uh, but mostly ebay they come in like it's weird because they come in so many different prices you got your price ranges you got some that are like 34 dollars some that are like 20 something dollars and then, you know some that are trying to cheat us and be like 50 bucks or whatever but for the most part they all kind of look the same i don't even think there's a company that actually brands it and it's just kind of like this cheap ferry from wherever i thought it was coming from china but it actually came from new york at least mine did i ended up getting one i, I ordered it from ebay it's like 30 30 bucks something like that when i first saw it i was like man that looks weird as hell but it also reminded me of the z1000 look where it feels like the headlight is facing down more aggressive look where the front of the bike the fairing in front of the bike on top of the headlight looks a little bit lower i'm gonna pull over here and give you all a look so you kind of know what i'm talking about instead of just me riding the bike and explaining it <sighs> all right so this is what i'm talking about guys this front nose fairing see how it like it's like a lip oh my bike is dirty so it's like a lip that uh comes down on the on the front and then you have this little two parts over here which my head looks like it's already coming off <laughs> uh you know it's cheap uh i figured i'll give it a try uh but you have these two parts right here that's held on by adhesive tape held on is a understatement <laughs> and you have to kind of cut the tape because it comes really large so you got to put it behind and then kind of use a box cutter to cut it in order for it to fit and then this right here is like the main fairing part that a lot of people a lot of people ask me let me turn on my lights before my battery dies a lot of people ask me if it affects lighting and at, at first i wasn't you know I, I thought it wouldn't affect the lighting but i drove it at night and i i hardly drive at night and it does so when you're on the bike this front nose fairing obviously pushes all the light down right in your front wheel and then you have like a marking on the front right and a marking on the front left but not straight ahead which is really really annoying i usually don't ride at night so i don't notice that um so if you like the look of it and you don't ride at night then it's whatever um if you do ride at night the one thing i like about this is that lip actually snugs up on your fairing uh and you don't really gotta put adhesive tape on it there is adhesive tape but you don't have to and then if you want to ride at night you just take this nose and pull it out and then you're gonna have the two parts right over here i mean that will stay obviously but then that kind of solves your problem 
on writing at night so the adhesive tape is kind of right here it's kind of all messed up now but i mean whatever so whenever you do want to write at night or write in the daytime i'm sorry you just throw this back on if you like the look of it i'm trying it out i'm not 100 percent sure if i like it it's kind of growing on me bike is dirtiest Ooh. it's kind of growing on me that side profile looks really really cool um and in the daytime the bike looks really cool looks like a different bike people think it's a people on the forum was asking me if it was a 2020 and if that's the new headlights and i'm like no it's just a front nose fairing and then you know a lot of people never heard of it because it's mostly on ebay uh so that's what it is that's all it is man um my review of the product if you like the look of it go get get it out through a link on uh the description below if you don't like it don't buy it i don't care uh but <laughs> But I, I kind of like it from the side profile. I do, you know, it doesn't really look much up front, but the side profile looks pretty cool. Anyways, that's the, that's gonna be it for the video, man. Uh, tell me what you think about the front nose fairing. It's kind of unique in its own self, I guess. Um, not many people have it on the Z900. Not many people have heard about it. <laughs> sauce new pizza new pizza restaurant oh yeah i put my uh my tail of the dragon stickers right over here and i'm pretty sure i'm rubbing it so bad that it's going to peel off in the long run well guys tell me what you think about the front nose fairing if you like it uh or what well, if you ride at night do you think it's going to affect maybe i'm telling you it's going to affect your lighting do you think putting leds or hids is going to make it any better i don't think so because it kind of pushes the direction like i said you can see it right in front of the wheel the lights and then you can see it on the front left and the front right but nothing right in front of you which makes it really really annoying now cars can still see you just they can still see your light obviously it's just not uh larger than it would be if you have it off so you can take it off you can put it back on ain't no big deal if you like it go get it guys i'll see you in the next one make sure you comment like and subscribe peace